Hi everyone, welcome back to another video for Fantasy Star Portable 2. So in today's video, we're just going to pick straight back up with the story from last time. So in the last episode, we got asked to go to a meeting with Ursula. There's apparently something that's um, confidential that she wants to discuss with us that concerns Amelia. So she's asked us to report to the Little Wing CEO officers. So we'll get straight started with that and see what Ursula's got to say. こっちのガーディアンズの方もクラウチに呼ばれているみたいよ。その様子を見るに同じ要件みたいね。そうですね、クラウチ It's interesting that Ursula doesn't know anything about it either. Chokseki It is also interesting that he's asked for Lumia to be here as well. Bear in mind that Lumia is not even with Little Wing. Okay, so it sounds like we've got our confirmation, so we'd expect we kind of expected this. But you know, we've actually got confirmation now that Shizuru is this man in black who's been going around terrorizing the entire Graal system. あいつが消息不明になるタイミングと失踪者事件のタイミングが一致した目撃証言も踏まえ、これは確定させられる。だがまあ、それはどうでもいい。問題は失踪者を逃走して。I mean, we kind of know what he's after because of obviously our dealings with Mika. We know that he's trying to get access to where the ancients are sleeping. But whether anyone else would believe that is another thing altogether. He's clearly collecting as much information as he can on the ancients to, I guess, to try and get as much knowledge as possible to facilitate him being able to access wherever they're resting. Wonder if Kras is starting to put two and two together here. Saishuakashizokutekotodeyutoanerawaretirundatomotetana. Yeah, so you've got to imagine that he's kind of starting to understand what's going on here. You know, it's clear that Shizuru is after anything to do with the ancients, and it's now very clear that the group that attacked Clad Six were here for Amelia. So if they're after stuff related to the Ancients, and they were here for Amelia, then clearly Amelia has something to do with the Ancients. Now obviously we know that already, because we, we've seen Mika, but no one else can see her. So I'm just going to stay quiet here, because I think saying why is just 
not helping the conversation. あの子を餌にしてシズルを I'm kind of surprised that Ursula sort of suggested using Amelia as bait. Like, that seems way too risky. I'm surprised that Ursula would even suggest that, to be honest. Unless she was saying it in jest. I kind of feel this isn't a situation where you would be joking around. Probably a bad time to walk in. Emilia. Ah, ah, so unfortunately, yeah, she's coming at the worst possible time and she's completely misread the situation. Kras is actually trying to protect her because he knows that Shizuru is after her now. But she's completely misunderstood this. I think because of how things happened previously as well, she's kind of used to Kras messing with her. Been a bit of a roller coaster for Amelia recently. Seems like we go from a, a real high in one episode to then the absolute lows in the next one. <laughs> the sad thing about this as well is that it is just entirely down to in incredibly bad timing. So we've got some missions, which normally means we need to do a free mission. So we've got fight for food and flaming horns. And we've got an update to Desert Oasis and Secret Society, which are the trade missions. So I'm kind of surprised that no one wants to talk, given what has happened. I'm going to assume that it's going to ask us to do a free mission. Take on an open mission while waiting for word from Amelia. See, in this situation, I would be thinking, why would you not go and try and find her? Anyone have anything to say? Kuno does. Watashini Hanashkake, Himana, I don't know. You saw the Emilia Woe. That's exactly what I was thinking. So, why are we not doing that? Dokoni Taka Wakara Nai to your Kotoba, Kokorota, you sweat the Sagastaka. Kimia Kanojo, Crouch in the Taisen Monkua.彼女の無事を確認し終えた後でじっくり言わせてもらおう。ただ一つ。先に言っておかねばならないことがある。彼女を見くれるな。彼女は子供だが、意思を持った人だ。それだけは絶対に忘れるんじゃないぞ。Yes, it's kind of like mixed messages, so you've got Kuno telling you why you're standing around, why you're not trying to find Amelia. But then the the mission is saying, go and do an open mission while we wait to hear from her. Which seems a bit contradictory. 
I'm assuming you're going to do the same. I'm 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 going to do the same. すなわち不安定な状態だというのを示しているましてや言葉の裏など読めるはずもない The other thing I would say as well is if that meeting was so confidential does, does Kraus not possess such a thing as a lock on his office? <laughs> 誤解が誤解を生んでの離別とはまさに親子の縮図再現といったところか Yes, again, basically everyone just saying, go and find Amelia. We'll just do one quick check just to make sure there's no one else. Ah, looks like that's it. So we can't invite Amelia, obviously. Right, so we'll do a free mission. So we'll do fight for food since it's just unlocked. I don't really fancy doing B rank considering it's level 65, so that seems a bit optimistic at the minute. So we have also, just off camera, we have actually upgraded some of our weapons to B rank because we can finally get B rank weapons in the shop. But not before time. Should be a pretty easy quest to do. Yeah, I've never really understood this part of PSP2. It's just always seemed weird to me that they, they're telling you to go and find Amelia, but at the same time, they're also telling you to do an open mission while you wait and use Amelia. Damage actually isn't too bad now. Yeah, I mean, you do feel sorry for Amelia, but at the same time, like, she has massively misunderstood what's going on. Kraz is obviously trying to keep it off active duty because he's worried about, you know, obviously there is a real danger to her if Shizuru and everyone that Shizuru is controlling is after her. So I can understand why Crisis is wanting to take her off active duty, it does kind of make sense. But at the same time, Amelia was just seen as everyone being against her again. And particularly, as I mentioned, with everything that's happened with Kras in the past, she just kind of assumes that Kras doesn't think anything of her. Kind of odd actually that you unlock this quest so late in the story because on PSU at least this was literally one of the first quests that you did. I think you did unsafe passage and then after that it was fight for food. So it's kind of unusual that it's so late in the day. 
I think we are. I think we're over halfway through story now. It's very similar to the PSU version of the quest, honestly. There is a few new enemies in it, though. So, Infinity, um, well, PSP2 and Infinity has quite a lot of new enemies to the game. So, you do get a few enemies here that weren't in the PSU version. The, the make it and poison you. Um, these are new to PSP2. These Jedins. The stuff here does actually weigh you down a little bit with the Ranger because, particularly the Senderlands, they do sort of rush you down quite quickly. No idea why those boxes are already broken. Yeah, maybe that's the way to deal with the sound lands, just do a charge shot straight away. Overall, look, very, very simple quest. Level So I think this is last block because I think these guys are the last ones you fight. Like Antonio said, shots suck against these. My charge shot did over 200 damage. I would suggest that means it doesn't suck. <laughs> yeah, very easy quest though. I was actually saving my SUV because I thought we might have got more seed vans after that first one, but didn't happen. Yeah. So, got escaped all. Always useful. Right, so let's go back to Clad 6 and see if, what's happened with Amelia. Yeah, I'm back already. I mean, to be fair, that didn't take very long.
So it looks like she has actually potentially left Little Wing. So we'll go back to Kraz and see if uh, anything else has turned up yet. So Yuta was really worried about Amelia as well, and sort of trying to calm him down is quite difficult because honestly, Amelia is normally one that calms him down. いなくなる時だけはきっちり綺麗にやり合って。どうやったかわからねえが、追跡座標のデータとかもきっちり消してやがるしよ。ただの家出だといいんだけど、失踪者事件に巻き込まれていたらと考えてしまうとね。This is the problem, obviously she has now skipped town, she now has no protection at all from Little Wing, and Shizuru is after her, so she's in like the worst possible situation at the minute. リトルウィングの正式な任務としてエミリアの捜索を行うことだとする。お前もユートもそいつに参加だ。引き受けてくれるな。I love that you can say how much does it pay. Like why would you ever say that? 正直、一番頼りになるのはずっと一緒にいたお前だ。yeah, it's like there is a time for joking around and this is not it. まだあいつの所在のヒントもつかめてねえんだ。まずはそこから調査を。おい、どうした? <laughs> I do kind of wonder what Mika's take is on this. See, that is literally what has happened, but obviously Amelia is just not seeing it that way. And you can kind of see why, because she's obviously came in at the worst possible time. Emilia? 
何をする気ですかみんなが認めてくれるような仕事をやり遂げればまた私を必要と思ってくれるはずだから。It's ambitious, but also very concerning. Tatoeba Inheritosha Akujo, Zembu Abaitari Tokane. Yeah, that seems like the worst thing she could do, considering that if she goes to Inhelp, it's probably putting her in very close proximity to Shizuru. Oi, Oi, who's the dog? So I guess Mika has essentially shown Kraz where Amelia is. Or is it that she's uh, she's maybe shown me actually? That makes sense actually because they said earlier in the game that because I essentially died at the start of the game, I'm one of the only other people that can see Mika. So I guess Mika has sort of shown me where her and Amelia are at the moment. That makes a lot more sense actually. <laughs> インヘルトシャの秘密地域じゃねえか。あのバカが。ちょっと待ってくらち。今の話信じちゃっていいの？正直、突拍子がなくて信用ならねえが、今こいつの言うことぐらいしか信じられるもんがねえんだよ。It normally would make sense to sort of go with Ursula with like the very logical side of things, but in this instance, not so much. お前らはこのままパルムに向かえ。俺はその他の可能性を探っておく。ガーディアンズにもエミリアが狙われてるって情報は回してやるから、現地で合流してそのまま捜索に当たれ。そんであのバカを見つけたら、真っ先に俺の
そちらとの共同任務をやってからルミアは何か切れた感じきっといい経験ができたのね私からもお礼を言わせてもらうわあーっと積もる話はまた今度時間がある時にでも依頼内容の説明は受けていますリトルウィング社員の創作ですね名前はエミリアエミリアまさかね So it seems like Maya maybe has some familiarity with Amelia by the way she reacts there. So you obviously picked up the the scent of um of Mika. More mystic mumbo jumbo. No, to be fair, in the past he has took us directly to where we need to go, so I trust him. So looks like Maya and Lou are both joining us. Yeah, Lou is clearly not convinced that she's here. <laughs> So the local fauna are behaving strangely, so given what we've seen previously, that's normally when the subspace experiment's going on. So uh, inhale experiment with subspace again. I remember these guys from PSC. I remember them being kind of annoying, actually. Probably anti intruder measures. I mean, I would imagine so. Are the anti intruder measures just dogs? <laughs> I'm going to assume probably not.
don't really like when it makes me use first person mode because it feels super like janky in this game. <laughs> Again, we got this like sort of linked to PSO as well with the like native life going aggressive. Yeah, exactly what I said earlier. So every time that in help do a subspace experiment, it looks like the native life gets aggressive. So yeah, as we get further in, in health, are just getting more and more shady. Free to attack the enemies at any point in NPCs. So this would be the anti-intruder measures I mentioned. I also like how those very convenient trees are there to stop you from walking around it. So I'm going to assume you're going to activate soon. Probably want to break these boxes, maybe. And maybe after we kill this. I'm going to assume that when we kill this, that trap is going to activate behind us. Something's coming, yeah, I wonder what. Easy. <laughs> Maybe not so easy. Okay, so we now know there are floor traps. Was it literally just that one? I somehow found the one floor trap. Unless they don't show up on the goggles. I was wondering why that Vary did so much damage, but it's a uh, attack buff one, that's why. Another gold over. I would see a V, but I'm always sort of conscious that maybe they'll spawn too. Which would be a much better use of it. But no matter if they won't. Honestly, shotgun seems a bit OP in this game.
さすがに現場は疲れるわねこんなことになるんだったら定期的に訓練受けておくんだったわ So I guess Maya has been slacking off a bit. Yes, but I'm going to go to the store. 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 Yeah, what's the bigger problem? I mean, that doesn't really surprise me given that pretty much every other organization is missing people as well. Yeah, I mean, I, mean, I think we have a pretty good idea who's behind it all. So, you know, this time, Lumia and それはあくまでデータ上の話でしょ。今回の一連の事件にはデータを超えた何か超常的なものが絡んでいそうな。そんな気がするのよね。この先気持ち悪い空気が流れてるぞ。え、この空気を僕は知ってる。雪山の洞窟の時と同じだ。すごく嫌な空気だ。そこってルミアの失踪者を見つけた場所？そこと同じってことは、もしかして？マヤさんはフォーメーションの後ろについてください。反応はありませ
So I guess we have to go this way next. So plenty of these guys. Thankfully these are really easy to deal with generally. Um, they don't have much health at all. Is there anything down here I can break that might hide safe arms? I'm just aware that's our main objective. I'd rather not miss any if, if I can. So can we go this way? No, we can't. So it looks like we can go this way though. So we've got timer switches, which, you know, we love. We do have seed farms there. I'm going to assume that's going to close in a second. Yeah, so what we'll do is we'll take care of these seed farms, then we'll go back and get the switch again. Hilariously, it has actually blocked out one of the seed farms. Okay, so now we'll go back and get the switch again. Hopefully we can make it through in time. Now these guys are always a bit scary because they can do a lot of damage from melee or from range. And they're bullet resistant as well, which is not ideal for me at the moment. Level 26. So there is a way here actually as well. So I guess we'll check up this way. You know, we do have another one of these traps here. I'm trying to understand the pattern it's doing. It's a very weird pattern it's doing. Funny thing is, it's actually pushing some of the enemies out of the way. Probably just want to make sure we don't get hit by that too much. Kind of looks like it's going like a figure of eight. Yeah, I think it's going like a figure of eight. So we do have another way here. I'm actually just going to check back quickly though because I, I have a feeling there was another way to go as well. I'm just conscious that our objective is to destroy as many of the seed as we can so I don't really want to miss any if I can help it. Yeah, because there is this way as well. So does this have any more seed farms? 
does. So there was a way to another block up the, the way that we went just previously. This also leads to another block, though. Hmm. Well, I guess what we can do is we can go to the next block and... ...and see if there's any seed farms, and then we can always come back, I guess, if we need to. Security fences. Because that looks like it's still blocked. Door is locked, you need a password. Okay. Password found in special research laboratory. Lock path in the last sector. Okay, so I do need to go back to where I was before. Okay. Kind of unusual for a mission to ask you to go back over, but I'm assuming that's what it means. Anyway, I mean, it said last sector, which is what this is. So I'm guessing I need to go to where I went before, like up these stairs. what else it would mean when it says last sector so I assume this is what it means again just make sure there's nothing this way Good. in health ruins special research lab okay I will say it doesn't look particularly like a lab These things, although they are only small enemies, they're actually a little bit annoying to deal with because the, the spin will continuously knock you over. I realise I am spamming the, the shotgun a lot, but honestly it's so useful at this point in the game. Also interesting that the seed in the uh, in health research lab. Okay, so we've got the door password. So now I guess we go back to sector three again. This is a very weird mission though, the, the fact that it makes you go between the different blocks.
And we've got some more state farms. Obviously, we need to defeat them because they are our main objective. I assume we now just go back down here again. I like how half the NPCs have got stuck somewhere. I guess they're back into Sector 3 again. <laughs> but there is that way there. I want to check out this password door first. It just seems like a good idea. a password to open door. Sure. Okay, so we have seed farms again, which is not much of a surprise. Why does it feel like everything is resistant to bullets? So we have found a stun resist, which is actually probably reasonably useful, actually. <laughs> so is that all that was for? Just, just for one enemy? I guess maybe that helps you get S rank, maybe. I mean, I can't see anything else in here that... I guess it is just for that one enemy. I suppose that maybe allows you to get S rank. Okay, so now I want to check this way. Honestly, I'm letting my NPCs do a lot of the work against these Dilma's ends because they are very scary to be near. That's a definite SUV spawn. I'm not sure how it missed the one on the left. That, that's uh, interesting. There's one taken care of. very very careful because they, these do hit really hard okay well hopefully that was enough yeah so we literally went to that extra block just for one enemy <laughs> I'm gonna assume though that the one enemy probably lets you get S rank Yeah, a little confusing at the minute, so again, all the seed is showing up. We assume it's probably Shizuru's doing. So we kind of know what's going on, but it would be impossible to explain this to them at the minute. 
周囲に異常なフォトン反応があります皆さん気をつけてくださいおおこの景色はリュクロス Yes, this is this is r a c o s So we've actually been transported to r a c o s apparently, which is really unusual. And that's why it's unusual because r a c o s was destroyed at the end of PSU. I think the obvious explanation is that this has been summoned by the Codex. So it looks like Amelia has been brought here. I'm guessing Amelia probably didn't come here of her own volition. I'm going to assume that something has happened and she's ended up here. Yeah, which way is she? I'm not even going to question it because he's been right every single time so far. I am totally happy to follow him at this point because he seems to be right a lot of the time. Okay, so we'll end that one there for today. So in the next episode, we'll push into apparently Rycross and try and save Amelia and try and figure out what exactly has happened, how, how we've ended up on Rycross. Again, I assume it's probably because of Shizuru's codex that he's got. Um, I would assume that's the only logical explanation at this point. But we'll, we'll try and push into Rycross, try and save Amelia and try and get to the bottom of what exactly is going on at the minute. So if you're enjoying the series so far, please consider liking and subscribing or joining as a member. I do these videos for members first initially, so members will normally get access to it on a Monday, and then everyone else will be able to see it on the Wednesday of that week. I also stream twice a week as well, normally on a Wednesday and a Sunday, and I also multi-stream to Twitch, which is at Section Skyli. You can also follow me on Twitter at Section Skyli, and I'll also leave a link in the description to the Discord as well, so if you want to play with us off-stream and play other games with us as well, feel free to join us on the Discord as well. Yeah, hope you're enjoying the series so far, and in the next one we'll try and save Amelia.